You're back again with another episode of the No Money Spent Buddy Squad in NBA 2K20. My team and 2K right now is dropping some of the most unrealistic cards ever. You got Bill Russell that has Hall of Fame Rain Extender and a 90-something three-pointer. Nowadays, everybody can play point guard, including this new Galaxy Opal out of position. Kevin Durant and also 2K ended up dropping some new logic codes. They also ended up dropping a new free Galaxy Opal event right now, which we got to do too. And we ended up selling a lot of our collection. So we're going to be redeeming a lot of MT in this episode. So if you're ready, leave a like right now on the video. Let's aim for three likes on this video right here. I know you guys can do it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And let me know down below in the comments right now, what was the last player that you ended up getting on your main squad? Let me know down below. And like I said, today we're back again with another episode. And we got to put in some logic codes first. And then we got to talk about the events. I do want to get this Galaxy Silver Point Guard Kevin Durant. Uh, but he's like 1.3 million. And I'm kind of like, you know, I, I don't know. I feel like there's something bigger coming. Right now, they're, they're trying to bait us into getting these cards. And I have a feeling that we're going to get, you know, we're going to be getting something huge. And then look at this. I have over 50 completed auctions. I sold so much. And we're going to be redeeming that a little bit later. But first, we got to go ahead and put in some locker codes. And uh, 2K actually gave us some really good ones. We got a Galaxy Opal locker code. We got some free packs. We got some tokens. We got everything like that. We might be seeing a token update market. Token market update soon, hopefully. Um, I feel like uh, the token market itself has been very... I think the last time they updated that one was a while ago. They updated the rewards, obviously, recently. But they haven't updated the, uh, the actual token market. So I'm hoping they bring us some new packs. And stuff like that but right now though we got some locker codes and uh we got some good ones too you could potentially walk away with a lot of mt this one right here is going to be tokens and packs and then it's going to be june since we are still in june over here and we're going to put in the first locker code uh put it in my bad i did not pause that it's just uh tokens and packs june very easy very simple this one just came out too and uh oh you can get 50 tokens okay that's a lot more than i was expecting hey Huh. I'm gonna go ahead and drop it. I kind of want to get the fan favorite pack because I feel like that's gonna be like super juicy So we're gonna go right about here. Oh, that might have been a little too much to the right unless I could Oh, I was hoping it would have like corrected itself But unfortunately though, I would not mind getting the 50 tokens because we do have over 2,000 and you never know what to get could update the token market with you just never really know and we do still end up getting a fan favorite pack not the one i wanted but i'll take it though those have galaxy opals too they got jeremy lynn and jr smith which could potentially give us a lot of mt so right there is the first locker code we got ourselves another one too and uh, this one's gonna be another june locker code and uh, we're gonna put it in it's gonna be oh this one's actually very simple it's just june and then diamonds. I believe this one's gonna give you the diamond consumable pack, which is really good because you can walk away with a shoe, you could walk away with a contract, and you can walk away with easy guaranteed MT. So here we go, June diamonds. Go ahead and put it in. Let's see what we end up getting. I'm going for the pack for sure because I think the diamonds are a little bit, you know, they're just, they're just not, <laughs> they're just not worth it. Even though that bridge, uh, that bridges card right there used to be one of the best diamonds in the game. If you know, you know. So we're gonna try to get the. Uh, oh, they're making it. Oh, okay. Hmm. I'm gonna drop it right. Oh, that was too much to the left. Oh, man. I have been so bad with my ball drops lately. I don't know. Oh, wait, wait, wait. But maybe, maybe I spoke too soon. Hold on. Wait a minute. Oh, oh, big money. Oh, 2K. Come on. Come on. Give me the contract. No, dude. It literally. Yo. It look. No. Bro, I mean, I'll take Miles. I sold him a while back. But look, dude, that was literally about a drop on the pack. And then it said no at the final second. I'll take it, though. Like I said, one of the best diamonds. Uh, that 2K released early on in the year, back in like March, I think it was. You know, we're already in June. 2K21 around the corner. It's gonna be crazy. I can't wait. I'm hoping for the best. You know, we'll see how that goes. Uh, but this next locker code is going to be a free Galaxy Opal locker code. And I'm hoping we do end up landing on uh, one of them because I do want to get one of those players. Even though, to be honest, even the Diamond, uh, I think T Mac is on this one too. Diamond T Mac is really good. Even though I think I have him already now that I think about it. Uh, either way, though, it is a free Galaxy Opa Locker Code, so make sure to put it in if you haven't already. This one's going to be Career Highlights and then Players. Very easy, very simple. Let's go ahead and put it in. And uh, again, you got some uh, Galaxy Opals on the board over here. So let's see what we land on. Let me see what we got, though. So they got him in the corner. Okay, hmm. We got... I would not mind, like I said, T-Mac, I think I already have him. So we're going to go for Devin Booker. I feel like he's probably the better Galaxy Opal out of the two that were available. So we're going to go all the way to the far left. I'm hoping I get lucky this time. Like I said, my ball drops, that's a good ball drop. My ball drops have been like, I don't know what happened, man. I used to be really good, and now they're just all over the place. Oh, no. Oh, oh, bounce over, bounce over. There you go. Let's get it, man. Leave a like right now for that good luck, bro. I just got myself a free Galaxy Opal. 
from a logic code. Hey, and I did not have him either. I, I always wanted to try him out because uh, it was like a, when, when he first came out, I got matched up against him and he was knocking down three pointers like crazy. So I will gladly take it. I did need a, uh, actually, I don't need a shooting guard anymore. Uh, but I'll take it though, man. Free Galaxy Opal, you can never go wrong with that. I will gladly take it. You know, that definitely, that made up for the diamond pack that I missed. So we'll take it. We do got another logic code though over here in the My Team Community Hub. And look at this event right here. It's a father, son, NBA player card uh, event. You end up getting, I'll show you guys the graphic. They ended up tweeting it out. Uh, you got Galaxy Opal Bobo. You got Galaxy Opal Steph Curry. And then you got some other Galaxy Opals here that they ended up just adding uh, to the game. As well as the pink diamonds and stuff like that. So definitely go play Triple Dread right now. We're going to try to get as many Galaxy Opals as we can, obviously. So make sure to take advantage of that event. That It expires on Monday. So like midnight. Like as soon as, the, as soon as it's Monday, it's over. So keep that in mind. So it's pretty much Saturday and Sunday. And then we do have a uh, locker code right here. My team community hub. Let's see what we got. Community pool. Where would you like to see? Oh, they're bringing back mystery packs. Hey. Huh. I think, I think they should do a triple threat online and offline. So if people want to play offline, they can play offline. If they want to play online, they can play online. But then again, what is this question mark? What if you just give us 100 each? I'm gonna go question mark. Why not, man? You never... Hey, I don't know. I wonder how many people uh, you voted on that. We do end up getting three tokens. I'll gladly take it. Wow, only 13% said question mark. Hmm, I'm a little disappointed. Dude, more people said domination. Are you... Why? 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 <laughs> Why would you want to play that? Okay, okay, alrighty. Okie dokie. Anyway, though, we gotta redeem a lot of MT. Look at all this MT that we ended up getting. Oh my goodness! We gotta redeem it. I advise you guys right now to go into your collection. Go into your collection and find those players. Let me show you guys like two players that are like super expensive. I did not have them, but I was like super surprised at how expensive they were going for. So check your collection. Look at the Sapphire Manupo. Look at this man. This card alone is worth more than what the collection is. And I believe this collection is Galaxy Silver Mark Eden. I guarantee you if Mark Eden was available, he would be going for less than 80,000 MT in the auction house. Like, easily less than 80k. And yet you got Sapphire Manu Ball, 90k. That's wild. I don't, I don't even... Like, he's just rare. That's what it is. And then another card is going to be uh, Bogut over here. This Bogut. I was really hoping that I had him in my collection. But I do not. But if you do have him, that's a lot of it. Look at that. Oh, there's only two in the auction house. Whoa! 70,000, bro. Check your collection. You could have a lot of MT. And then obviously sell the shoes. Sell the jersey, sell the players, etc. That's pretty much what I ended up doing. So now we got to redeem all of this MT, bro. Are you guys ready? We got to redeem all of it. We're at 300,000 MT right now. And uh, let's just go ahead and get started. Are you guys ready? Because I'm ready. So here we go on the count of three. One, two, and three. Let's get right into it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume we're going to have about, mm, I want to say, I don't know. To be honest, I have no idea. I want to say I have probably like... I'm definitely going to be over half a million for sure because I did end up selling some Galaxy Opals. Like I said, I ended up just going through my collection. Some Rubies were going for a lot of MT. You know, some Amethyst. Uh, John Morant, uh, he ended up dropping. That was the pink, pink diamond one from the logger code. Uh, you got Miles Turner. We sold him for 11,000 MT. Not the most MT, but it's all good though. So definitely check your auction house. You just never know when you have a lot of MT. Especially if you do like the logger codes, you play triple threat and stuff like that. You got a lot of MT in your collection and you don't even know about it. Just go through it, sell it all. We got Larry Johnson over here, 10,000 MT. That was the pink one too. Uh, we got Tracy McGrady. We got Jaron Jackson. I pretty much ended up trying to sell all the cards that I could. Some silvers were going for a lot of MT still. 4,000 MT for that one. I will gladly take it. Uh, a lot of the bronzes I did end up selling from 750 to like 800. Even the jerseys that were going for over 500, I sold them too. The Heat one right here sold for 2,700. You know, sometimes some jerseys are very rare. You definitely do want to sell them. Because right now, like, people are trying to get Anthony Davis. They're trying to get this and that. They're trying to get their collector level up. Sometimes they're just fans of, you know, the, the team itself. Like, the Lakers, the Heat, they have a lot of value because a lot of people like to rep them. So a lot of people do like to buy them. Even though right now, a lot of people are opening packs. I sold these... Uh, I, I've been selling this for like the past weeks. So I've just been, you know, going through my collection and doing stuff like that. But that's a lot of MT that we're getting. We're almost up to 400,000 MT. And like I said, I did end up selling some of the Galaxy Opals too. I am still saving some of them because I do have a feeling that Prime Packs should be coming out very soon. If they don't come out this next Friday, they'll probably be the, the following Friday. 
because I feel like they definitely do want to finish that up very soon. So definitely expecting that uh, as well. And uh, luckily, I did end up selling the diamond contracts before that logic code that I showed you guys came out. So I'll take the 21,000. I'll take the 22,000. I'll take another 22,000. And look at that right there. Almost 500,000 MT once again. Jay Williams over there. Isaac Bongo. I actually got those from logic codes too. Got pretty lucky. Uh, they've been giving us a lot of those... Um, what are they called? The uh, the Captain's Legends and a lot of the Leap Gear Packs too. So definitely use those logic codes. Some of this stuff did not sell, unfortunately. Well, I'm surprised. Oh, okay. I'm surprised these did, these did not sell. All right, we're going to go ahead and send those to the auction house, though. You know, I'll sell them later on. But we got ourselves a Frank over here for nearly 3000 We got Sekui. Hopefully, I'm saying that name correctly. A lot of cards that I saw, like I said, just went through my collection. You know, I just wanted to get rid of everything. I'm still deciding if I'm going to go for Goat Kareem or if I want to go for that uh, Galaxy Opal point guard Kevin Durant. Even though, to be honest... They should have made Kevin Durant a GOAT card and should have made him the reward instead of uh, Jonathan Isaac. That would have been very interesting, but it is what it is, though. Some of these uh, players, 1,300 MT, I'll take it. You'd be surprised. We sold Taco, too. Taco ended up falling in price. I see what I did there. Taco fall. fall. Anyway, we sold him for 100,000 MT. He had to go. Eddie Jones. I've been wanting to sell that card for a while. I was going to evolve him, but his price was already dropping that I decided to get rid of him. So we got Jordan over here, too. We got Amir. We got a lot of uh, bronzes. Like I said, I pretty much just put most of them up for 750. And look at the MT right now, bro. We're at almost 600,000 MT. Let's go, man. And the best part is, I still haven't even, like, I haven't sold everything. I still got more jerseys. I still got more players and stuff like that. Like I said, I haven't cleared my auction or my collection since I started the No Money Spent Squad, which was back in, I think, December. So I have about, you know, six months worth of players and cards and just items that I can definitely sell. So it was finally time to do that. And we're about to hit uh, 600,000 MT. Hey, we're getting there. Almost. Almost there. Some of these did not sell, like I said, unfortunately. I might end up just quick selling them. We'll see how that goes. But look at all this MT, though. Oh, my goodness. Yo, bro. If you made it this far into the video, comment down below right now. How much MT do you have? But look at all this MT. I did end up selling um, my... Wow, we still got over 50 items. Wow. Okay, this is gonna... This might take a while. Oh, my goodness, bro. Look at all this MT. Oh, dude. We're gonna be big ballers, man. Big baller Carlos over here. Derrick Rose had to go. Norman had to go. A lot of cards, uh, you know, we're selling for 750, which is still better than the quick sell value. You know, even if you sell them for like 700, stuff like that, obviously some did not sell. A lot of the golds did have value, which was great. And then obviously some of them did not end up selling. But look at all this MT, though. We're at 600,000. Oh my goodness. We're big ballers. Dude, oh yeah. Oh, my boy JJ, dude. I got lucky with JJ because I ended up, there was none in the auction house. Uh, there was like a bunch that were fully bought, so I sold them. Same with Steve, too. Like, you never know. Sometimes you check the auction house and there's just like no cards uh, for the card that you're trying to sell. So definitely do that if you haven't already. And right now we're at, uh, let's see, let, let me, let, let's, uh, let's let it load. I just want to see how much we're at right now. So we're at 618,000 MT right now. We started with 300,000 MT. We're looking like big ballers. I don't know if I showed you guys the team. The team, look at the team. Team looking pretty good. You know, we got Magic, Team at KD, Bobo, and Kareem. I did not sell Bobo. Uh, you know, the events is going to drop his price, but I figured I would just keep him just, just for now. And you know what I realized? I ended up getting Tracy McGrady for a 500 MT, and then as soon as I got him, 2K ended up adding him to Triple Dread Online as an event. And then when I ended up getting Kareem, they dropped a GOAT, Galaxy Opal Kareem. And then when I got Magic... They also dropped a GOAT Magic Johnson, and then obviously they dropped the point guard Kevin Durant, and now Bobo is in triple threat, so I thought, you know, that's a nice little coincidence, very interesting, but uh, let's go back to redeeming the MT, you know, 2K over here, man, they, uh, you know, you just never know who might get a GOAT card, you never know who might be in triple threat online next, you just never know, all I know right now is that we gotta get to at least, we gotta get back to a million, I think that's gonna be the goal, and we saw, oh, look at Clay Thompson though, Clay Thompson, give me that MT! Let me get all that MT. Come on, load it up, load it up. I, oh, yeah, even after tax, we're at over 700,000 MT. Let's go. Even though he was going for 188,000 in the last episode, um, I tried to sell them right away, but I think I just put them up at the worst time because they ended up dropping uh, Super Packs uh, when I ended up selling that one too. So a little unfortunate, but it's all good though. Mine did have a diamond contract in his shoes, so I'll gladly take it. And then we got some more cards over here that we got to sell. So these jerseys, mmm. I'm trying to think. So we're at 771, huh? Interesting. So I do still have, let me show you guys the uh, Galaxy Opals that I do still have to sell. 
because I definitely do have a lot to sell still. So obviously you guys saw the main squad. We just got Devin Booker from the Logger Code. Uh, we might end up selling Chris Webber. We got lucky and pulled him in the last episode. Check out my reaction if you haven't already. And uh, we still got to sell Luca. Luca right now is going for about... He's almost back up to 200,000 MT. It's still pretty cheap in my opinion. I feel like he might be the most... Uh, he's definitely the more... Actually, he's not even that much that rare anymore because they keep dropping sword packs. Uh, we still got Lamar Odom, which I got to sell as well too. Oh, oh buddy, you went... Yo, so we can definitely get back to 1 million. I don't even, even want to check Kareem's price because I know I know that boy just keeps dropping and dropping and dropping. Magic, I think we took a W because, uh, yeah, we definitely... You know, we took a W with Magic, so I'll gladly take that. The good thing about Magic is that he's basically the same thing as the GOAT card, so his value definitely stayed a little bit. We got Kevin Durant, who also dropped a little bit too, but I'm gonna go ahead and keep those, you know, because they still are in the starting lineup. So right now, we gotta decide, like, we got 700,000 MT once again. We're obviously gonna get to over 1 million very soon, as soon as I saw those cards. I'm just waiting uh, for, you know, the Prime Pack collection reward to be revealed, and hopefully it's someone really good. And so I, I'm gonna save those for a little bit more, but I'm trying to debate if I wanna... Because, like, I still want to get that Galaxy Oppo Goats Kareem. But Richard Lewis right now, he got even more rare. Look at this man right here. He's going to, yeah, he's easily going to be, like, two. Wow, there are none in the auction house. There's, wow, there's, what, four, five, six, six. Wait, no, four, five, six, seven. There's seven. Wow. Um, Yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to afford that. Because, to be honest, uh, I feel like this center right here. And I was talking to my stream about it. And uh, some of them agree. This man right here is way too good to be going for under 200,000 MT. And uh, he basically has, you know, 94 three-pointer, 95 driving dunk, and stuff like that. So definitely worth getting. 92 speed too. Wow. The other card that I do want to pick up is obviously going to be the Kevin Durant. Uh, he's definitely a lot cheaper. And I would probably run him at shooting guard over point guard. Just because he is 6'10", which is interesting because my Kevin Durant is 6'9". And they're from the same team. So, like, how did he get an inch taller? I don't, I don't, I don't understand. Like he's six nine on that card, but on my card, why, why, why is he six nine? It's the same team, so it's not like, you know, if that would have been the Warriors or, or whatever, that I would have been like, okay, maybe, you know, yeah, maybe, maybe he grew an inch. Who knows? Even though we all know he's like a seven footer out there. Um, but yeah, he's six ten on this card, which I just yo two get. Can we update the other one? Like, please, please, and thank you. That'd be great. So I gotta decide on who to buy there. And then there's also another card by the name of Giannis. I don't know if you guys have heard of him. By now, you should know his name. Uh, but this man right here, though, he is a shooting guard who is going for... Wait, what? Is he not a shooting guard? Am I, am, I, am I missing something? What is he? Oh, he's, se oh, he's center. My bad. Sorry, center uh, Giannis, also shooting guard. He's looking uh, pretty good, especially a 6'11 shooting guard. It's really nice. However, though, he does not have range extender, so that is going to be a problem. Ooh, 80k. Wow. Hmm. You know what? Huh. I wonder... I wonder if I can get him for, like, 70k. Because even 70k would not be bad. Let's just refresh, like, three times. You never know. You never know. Sometimes... Hey, people are opening packs right now. You just never really know. There's also another player that I do want to look at who could potentially be our starting small forward. And I'll show you guys that in a bit. As soon as this loads, ah, oh, he's still 80k. But the other card that I do want to look at is going to be one of those unrealistic cards that 2K ended up releasing. And that's going to be my boy Bill Russell over here, man. Like, I don't know if you guys saw him play. I didn't, you know. But at the same time, when he was playing, there was no three-point line. And yet, he's 6'10 with a 93-pointer. And on top of that, he has Hall of Fame range extender. I just... I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I really don't know what to say to that. Other than, uh, it, it's just so weird, too. Because, like, Giannis, he doesn't have range extender. But, yeah, you give it to Bill Russell. And I'm like, why? I, I just, I just want to know why. And we'll say again. I do want to, we do have more MT, actually. And I just realized, let me clear that real quick. Uh, I do still have shoes that I got to sell. I have not been selling them. I do have a diamond shoe from, like, a previous episode. I don't remember the last time uh, it was. I think it was, like, four episodes ago. I never sold it. His, it, it, it the price definitely dropped a little bit. Uh, I might end up saving it for like Embiid or somebody else. We'll see. So let me go ahead and send that to the auction house now so that I don't accidentally quick sell it. And I'm going to go ahead and just quick sell all these shoes really quickly. And uh, we're just going to fast forward it. That way I don't bore you guys with, you know, selling shoes. Even though some of you guys do like watching that. But, you know, we're going to go ahead and just quick sell them all. And then go on Triple Threat and try to get some Galaxy Opals for free. So we got about like nine pages. So uh, let's get started. We're just, we're just going to sell them all. 
I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to keep the uh, three point shoe ones, but we're gonna sell every single one. One eternity later. And finally, we sold them all. I am gonna keep these couple ones that we got left over. I'm just gonna save them. And basically, we quick sold all of that. I do still have like a lot of players that I do still have to sell. Like I got some gold players left over. I got you know some uh, you know some premium players. You know we got some rubies and stuff like that. So we'll go through that a little bit later. But right now though. We got, a, you know, we got over 800,000 MC, but now we have to go get ourselves the free Galaxy Opals. I do want to see how much Bobo is going for right now, now that he is available. I have a feeling he's going to be pretty rare, but you never know, though. He, he, ooh, he might be... Yo, if you get him, you get, like, an easy 100,000 MT. Yo, he's about, like, 95. Okay, that was expected. So he dropped a little bit, not too much. He's about, like, 90. Yo, if you get him, that's easy MT right there. And then, obviously, you got Kirby, too, which are probably going to be the two that you want to go for because those you can't sell. The other ones you cannot. And is he 100K? Let's see. He might, oh, okay. Yeah, we definitely... We, we got to go get... We got to go get ourselves some Galaxy Opals. Uh, we're going to go ahead and rock with this team for now because I do still got to evolve Bobo. I'm definitely still going to evolve him before I even decide to sell him. So, let's get right into it, man. We got to go get ourselves as many free Galaxy Opals as we can. So, I advise you guys to do the same thing. Go play Triple Threat Online right now. Get yourself a free Galaxy Opal, Bobo, Steph Curry, and then obviously the other Galaxy Opals that are available too. And here we go. Let's see what we got. Who's going to be our opponents? I feel like everybody's going to be sweating right now, bro. 12 seconds later. Oh, look at this man right here. He's a Knicks fan. Oh, that, that, I'm sorry, man. That must suck. But he's got Karolinko. Oh, I forgot to look at Karolinko. He might be super cheap right now. I'm definitely going to look into him. We got Marcus Song. We got Larry Bird. Okay. I mean, our team, man, you know. He might have a GOAT card, but it is what it is. Now, I'm rocking the Magic jerseys right now because I saw the Heat ones because they are way too expensive to be keeping. As that Larry Bird literally just drove by me. Hello? Okay, we got to play some defense. What's up, Karolinko? If that Karolinko drops like 100 points on me, even though it's not possible, but if he does, I'm definitely going to pick him up. Especially because I have a feeling he's going to be super cheap. Nah, nah, Curry. Nah, nah, nah. I almost called him Curry. I don't know why. Look at this lockdown defense, though, buddy. Hey, oh, he tried to. That was a good pass. He, dude, if he would have got that through, that would have been an easy dunk. My goodness. But we got my boy T-Mac out here, bro. This guy out here off-balling. Come on, big fella. Don't off-ball me, man. I got Bobo. He's a demigod out here, bro. D up. I feel like the gameplay has been changing so much uh, lately in 2K. Like, it's really annoying. He's trying to... Nah, <laughs> you're not. You're not going to get those passing lanes right now, buddy. I'm sorry. Maybe 2K right now is, you know, testing out, you know. <laughs> they're testing out the gameplay for 2K21. As we get a nice little green with my boy T-Mac out here. Oh, you see, like, I feel like any little thing that I do, I feel like I'm on skates. It's really weird. Weird. Oh, that Karolinko. Ooh, I might have to get that Karolinko. But right now, though, we got to get those free Galaxy Opals. Oh, my God. T-Mag with the snap. Ooh, that was nasty, bro. Dang. I really want to get some assists out here because I definitely want to evolve Bobo. So we're going to do that right there. Quick little assist to my boy KD. Oh, KD, you can't be missing that, buddy. You know T-Mag ain't missing. T-Mag ain't going to miss that one. Let's go, Bobo. That's a quick little assist. I think I'm very close to evolving him, too. So hopefully we get that done. We got to start with those assists, though, because uh, it's not working out. Oh, look at KD, though. Look at KD. Okay, I'm going to get one. I got to I gotta at least get one. The problem with trying to get assists with Bobo is that, you know, sometimes you get easy baskets that you got to give up, which is a little unfortunate. But there we go. Nice little pass to my boy KD. That's a green, baby. Let's go. And that's another assist. We got three. And we got to give it to Bobo. There you go. I could take that. I could take it. But let's give it a team for the wide open midi. That's another green. The gameplay just feels so weird now. I don't know what they did to it. Give that a team Mac though. We're going to pause it right in his face, bro. Let's go, man. You know, just a little disrespect for him off-balling me. Tracy McGrady, still one of the best cards in the game. Look at that score, though. 23 to 14. Wow. Everybody, everybody did their thing, though. 14, 5, and 4. Yeah, you love to see it. All right, you know what else I love to see, 2K? Show me those free Galaxy Opals right now. Give me a Bobo. Give me Curry. Give me both. If I can get both, I'll be happy. Just kidding. I just want to get one. At least, at least give me one. Here we go. Drop the ball. Let's see what we get. Oh, there's no Galaxy Opal. Man, I wonder if they're only available in the fifth ball drop. Even though I've had, I've had some of the worst five ball drops ever, bro. I don't know what it is, but I have had like some very bad ones. Like I get like one token, two tokens, and stuff like that. I'm going to go ahead and drop it. I guess I'll go for... It doesn't really matter. We'll just go ahead and drop it. We got three that we can drop right here. I'll take the MT. I'll take the tokens. You know, I wanted a free Galaxy Opal, but it's all good, though. We got, you know, we got the whole weekend, you know, try to play. I'll probably try to play on stream. Everybody follow me, twitch.tv slash Story. I'm streaming the No Money Spend Squad and stuff like that. So we'll definitely be doing a lot of games, too, as we get two tokens right there. Hey, let me get the pack. I'll take the pack. I still got to open those packs. I know you guys are probably wondering, Carlos, when are you going to open those packs? I'm going to open them soon, okay? I was just trying to clear my collection right now, so that way I can open them, and then I can send the players to the auction house without having to quit 
quick sell them. Even though some of them I am going to quick sell, so we'll see how that goes as we land on that once again. It's okay, I'll take, I'll take the 250 MT. Not too bad. But yeah, we got a lot of triple threat to play. I do want to get that bowl one, that curry, because that's an easy 100,000 MT. Because you're going to get MT from selling it, and you're going to get MT from whatever you get, you know, up to that point. So, for example, you're going to play like an hour, you're going to get tokens, you're going to get packs, then you're going to get MT, and then hopefully you end up getting a free Galaxy Opal, maybe a Bobo, maybe a Curry, maybe a different reward one, as I almost cleared that whole wheel right there. Hey, let me get the 400. 400, come on, 2K. Come on, 2K. Don't you dare reset. There, there you go. Give me the 400 MT. Yo, we're out here. Yo, we're big ballers now, man. 807,000 MT. Yo. All right, you know what? You know what? I, I gotta, I gotta go grind it out. I'm actually gonna be streaming uh, later on today. So right now, I gotta edit this video, bring it out to you guys, give you the locker codes, give you the, uh, you know, updates to the Triple Threat Online event and stuff like that. But we're gonna call it right there. Hopefully, you enjoyed this episode of No Money Spent. We got up to 800,000 MT. Uh, you know, we got a free Galaxy Silver from the locker code too, and uh, we now have to go for those free Galaxy Opal. So if you enjoyed it and you want that extra good luck. Then leave a like right now on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out the three videos that I uploaded. I did a Throwback Thursday video to 2K19. Really good video. Check out the previous episode of No Money Spent Buddy Squad so you guys can see what we ended up doing there. And then also check out the pack opening that I did with the new packs. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.